Hello, baby.
<laughs> okay. I was just about to say I can't see, but it's because I was looking over my glasses. had a sudden thought that it wasn't Wednesday. Alright. Him <sighs> is... on the hood. It's really cute. Oh wait, do I actually I think we won't green eyes. And yes, we clearly need a tail. It's really cute. Spots. Ooh, but stripes. Oh, I like the dots. Where's color three? Oh, it's the clothing underneath. Okay. Hi, Stu. A light. Socks long. Okay, so the color goes from those. So yes. Oh yes. Yeah, this is one that I've been looking forward to playing for a little while. And, uh... I wasn't... I wasn't going to do... Play the demo, I was just going to wait for full release. But I recommended it to Drax. It's something he might want to look at, and he said he really enjoyed the demo, and I was like, well, shit. <laughs> So I I decided I had to. Um it's due out in April. Okay, so that's my little my little dude. Croissant is clearly what we should use as a seed. A 
it is me. Calm, quiet day, and you're relaxing on your bench. I'm hopeful that the music will do. Hi, Sadie. I need my cardi, I'm cold. It's hard getting temperature right for stream because, you know, like the in the sort of 10, 15, 20 minutes before stream, you're usually like zooming around like a blue ass fly. Getting things ready, sort of picking the up and putting them down and turning lights on and and then you stop moving and you're like oh wait I'm cold now okay <laughs> not sure about the music we'll see so this is like uh it's an automation game but it's got a story um, and the demo is available publicly. I was in a demo key through Keymailer, so I, I don't know if there's any difference. All of my daily tasks are done and the warm sun gently lulls you into a midday nap. Oh, yes. Sounds good. Also, well, I'm sorry, I've got some colour bleed coming through right now. The sun is doing some things pincher it is it's true hi mel no it's new bee land this intrigues me it's got wings and a trunk. But yeah, you're right. Other than that, um, I do have family in Ontario, but I don't know if they stream. A, a bunny with eight eyes and six legs. I definitely have family in Ontario who are performative. I have a brother who uh, owns a curio slash museum, or like a curio shop slash museum with like bones and archaeological stuff, uh, and, and a sister who owns a bookshop, runs a bookshop. Um, but I don't, I don't know if either of them stream. Uh, why do you ask games? Yes, New Zealand is an abomination. Well, second part of the world, it doesn't even exist anymore. Like it, it did exist, but then a certain, yeah. Oh. I don't know. They're half siblings, and all of my siblings have very, very, very bright red hair. They're all ginger. Oh. Oh, uh oh. Something broke. Hi, Mega Jelly Mac. Uh. When you are in aim mode. Hey! Someone broke the sh- oh. Okay. <gasps> I don't know. Her. 
is that her channel name? Yeah, let me... Does she have a camera up? Yeah. No, that's not my sister. No, I'm the oldest of all the siblings by quite a lot. The rest of my siblings are all young and ginger. Uh, but yes, actually, um, my my brother is is quite the Goliath, quite the furry, uh, ginger giant. Um. And very comfortable with himself, which is amazing. In fact, all of my sibs are in a pretty good themselves. I've never spoken to any of them. I just know who they are. Like I've had some interactions with my sister on uh, on Twitter, but. Can't oh, fuck, I can't remember his Instagram account. I'm gonna have to look it up now. Natural selections, here we go. Daisy is going bad shit. This is, this is my, one of my brothers. He's a goofball. If anyone's interested. Um, I do look a lot like my dad apparently, but I don't know. Okay, I have to replace my shed. Wait. Oh, okay. Oh, there's directional sound. Okay. Open the map to find the woodsman. That guy. Ice marker. Is that what I... Oh, okay. They'll do. Is it this way? Oh, this is really cute. What is this? Hello? He's just like balancing on this big pile of books. Oh, he's a researcher. Oh, no. Why the books? It's because I'm outstanding on my research. Oh, oh. Oh, good. There's an unstuck button. But also, oh god, there's an unstuck button. Lock on enemy? Is it beard? Wait, <laughs> it, it is. Wait, can I have these? Okay. How do I get rid of the marker? Oh, like that. Hi. Is 
everything crashed into your shed? Okay. It wants to know how you rebuild the shed, but that requires some logs. Get logs from the logger. We'll harvest them from bushes in the village. Okay. Infinite resource, wooden log. I see. Gotta hold the mouse down. Interesting. If you're ever stuck, your quest log contains. Okay, sure. Mm -hmm. Deliver. Wait, where am I? Oh, in here? Am I delivering the logs in here? Oh, God. Yay! I love this stuff. It's got a. It's a, looks like it's a musical instrument. It's got buttons to press, like a a trumpet and a a horn end. Mm. Yes, that song timber you need. Okay. Oh, I like that. You can still see your character behind things. Oh, you can still see things behind things. The Grand Toot Staff? Grand Toot Staff of Tootening. It's for the tutorial. Now, use the build menu. Oh, I can put it anywhere? Okay, no, I can't put it anywhere. There is bounds. I mean, that was where it was before. I'm like, now, now my first one is like, wait, can I get rid of the... Oh boy. <laughs> I saw refiners and assemblers and had satisfactory flashbacks. Okay. Hey, buddy. I love weird things. Ooh, what if I poke it? Oh god. I I don't read quest dialogue because I'm not very good at getting all the intonation and stuff and so it sounds interesting, so I do tend to skip over it. <coughs> Magic devastation? A spark? Oh. Okay. Look at the village monument yeah. oh. okay okay can we free explore the oh there's no jump uh, oh there's no jump okay so there's like a little marker down here where i can wait who's this hey she's in a wheelchair and it's cool such a busy beelephant There's bee elephants? I'm assuming their chests are all for like quests and stuff. 
Yeah, it is. She says that. Oh, okay. What is... A bee live fence. They're totally different. <clears throat> hmm. Oh, okay. I love the art style in this. Danger. Dangerous levels of corrupted ether detected. Cleansing pulse routine initiated. Cleansing pulse. Are we about to get sterilized? Oh. Ah, this way. <clears throat> the, the movement feels really nice and smooth. And the camera motion as well. There's no, like, stuttering when you're going up and downhill. I don't look to see if there's any, um... Accessibility for settings. It's nice that they've got remapping. Epic. So, I finally stopped fucking around the other day and set like just everything to cap at 60 frames in NVIDIA. So, so I was getting tired of games like getting greedy in menus. Shrouded was really bad with that. <gasps> Luna! Thank you. Thank you. Luna, thank you for a whole heckin' year. Heck yeah, a year. Heck. Oh, toggle. Yeah, you can. But I play games that aren't on Steam as well. So... And I don't need a command line argument if I just do it in NVIDIA. And then having to mess around with Steam. Purple, I got you. I actually got starters on the, the scarf last night. Um, Because I set it to just be like a fixed length. Okay, so just imagine the... Oh no, everything's showing. Wait, no, imagine this bit that you can't see is green. Um, but because it's all a fixed length, um, I can just add it onto a skein of yarn. Um, and I'm able to use this, this handy little yarn spinner that Stu sent me for my birthday to hold the skein. So I can just keep on adding color onto the outside of the cake and winding it on. Like, how e easy is that? Yeah. So it's worked out really well. Uh, purple. Purple, purple. Yeah, it's a great little thing. It's it's probably designed more for not using center pull, but it's still really handy. Just to stop the yarn from scooting away. I'm gonna have to add something like some little rubber stoppers or something, but it's it's very useful. 0207. Luna, purple. Yeah. So every um, what I'm so tangled up. Every sub uh this year gets a section of yarn added onto this. Oh, the color is like super saturated. Oh no. <laughs> um. And it's basically like it's a fixed width of like three times the width of my desk. So I could just like tie it into a big skein of yarn or a cake, I guess. 
All right, note has been taken. Thank you, Luna. I... Oh no, this idle animation is adorable. Like looking behind them. Um, button prompt. Okay. I much prefer toggle for things rather than. Whoopsie. Um. Oh god. I keep on trying to to like tilt the camera. Researcher believes the threat should be taken seriously. Finding even a single spark key that no one has ever seen or heard before before will be difficult. Nine sound. Oh, okay. Never mind. Uh, it would not be possible to complete this quest for a while. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. Just be careful. Okay. Okay. okay so what I what I know so far is log timber and leaves, and I can make sheds. Okay. Okay, I, I'm not even ready for that shit yet. Uh, mm -hmm. uh -huh. We're technically not allowed to go outside, but I won't tell anyone. Okay, sure, mm -hmm. let's go. <laughs> there was there was a game that I played on Gamepedia. And all the NPCs just made noises. Ah. Uh, just made like vocalizations rather than talked, and one of them was a lot like that. Are those? Oh, they've got a pig leg. Oh. Okay, that's the mirror. Um, <clears throat> I'm not sure. Uh, I did say. Oh, let's see if there's anything on the the list here. I know it's out in April. April 24th is launch day. Um, I don't see any mention. I don't believe so at this point it doesn't say anything i don't see any mention of switch but it's news on um it's news on steam so they might not post about it uh 
don't know if their website says anything. That's a, it's a good question. That's why I'm looking into it further. Because it feels like, it, so far, it feels like it may be a good Switch game. So far, only Steam and Epic, by the looks of it, going by the actual website. So only on PC for now. Yo, have a rockin' day. Oh. Oh, hey! I just, like, climbed up a hill. Like, there was no effort. You just kind of do it. Oh, I'm not allowed in there. That's cool. All right, well, I guess that's the extent of the town. <coughs> oh, that's cute. All right, let's go check out this mine. It's supposed to be co-op with like four people. Oh, oh my god, what is this? Hello? What are you? A field spunny. Oh no, they're really cute. They're like spider bunnies, but not terrifying. Uh -huh. Oh, why? Look at that. They got little ears. Oh, my heart. Look at their little feet. Oh, okay. I was expecting this to be whoa, be a mine. What is this? Requires a logger building to harvest. Okay. Oh no, I love them so much. Okay, I was curious about the the edge here. I love the way that their little feet move. They remind me of um, the Boov from the movie Home, which is like my favorite movie. Okay, let's see how far. I really like that I'm not having to argue with the game to like go up or down. Hi, Ravi. I love these guys so much. God, it just wow! It just got really large. Holy crap! It's so huge. This map is monstrous. Oh dear. It looks like a... The, the remains of a... A spunny. <gasps> what? A bealephant corpse? Oh. Those are big. Can't do anything with that. It's like all of a sudden, it's like a little, a little bit more darker. 
wait. Ether shard and etheric pellet. Ah, this is adorable. Well, now I want to find a real bealefin, like a, a live bealefin. Bealefant. Oh, okay. I'm not allowed in the air. Fine. <coughs> Go back before it's too late. But look, it's a... E ha! I don't think they did anything fancy, but still. Okay, this is a really <gasps> Oh no, it stomps! Nobody, come back! Oh, 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 what the fuck? I love it! It's shy. It's turning away from me. Oh no, I just did like a snuffle with its nose. <laughs> it turned in. But the wings. I know. Oh, I love him so much. Okay. I'm gonna let him carry on with his day. Not me almost crying because it's so cute. Ooh, can you swim? No, you can't get in the water. Maybe. That's true, because of the spunnies, too. Oh, I just realized for some reason I was like, spunnies? Hi, Sin. They, they must be because they're like bunnies, but they spin, not spider bunny. Sorry, I did see a message before. I just, I was a little distracted. Uh, it is a next face demo, a hundred percent. Like, I think you could just like generic bug this. It's a very good question. <laughs> Mal. Honestly, I was mildly tempted by that game, but just like seeing how, seeing the number of people going into pe No, I don't tend to play maybe Star Tracker. But I don't tend to play demos because I if I get into a demo and then the game's finished and then I have to wait. And I don't like waiting. But yeah, just like seeing the amount of people just being like pedantic dickheads for streamers who are trying to play a game and just have fun. I'm like I can't be fucked. Like, I still remember when I was trying to play Genshin and I had one particular dickhead, like, this is just like Legend of Zelda. And I was like, oh. It really takes the, uh, 
Takes the fun out of games. Yeah, that's what I said, because Siri was really excited about it. It's a game that Siri really wanted me to play. And I was like, I think I'm just going to wait till it's released, because I know there are some pretty significant bugs in it. I'd rather wait to have, you know, all the bugs squashed and then have a, a pleasant first experience with it. Oh, but that's a chest. That's totally legit, actually. I, I really enjoy it in Shrouded. Um, I totally burned down on it in three days. So cool. Um, but yeah. You made a hobbit hole? Oh, God, I'm stuck. Oh, wait, what? Okay, don't touch the gray. Yeah, because I suppose Valheim's Ashlands is coming out soon, I think, right? Yeah, and you're you're paying for their development. There's so many other games out there as well. Like, I think, especially as a streamer, it's really hard to wrap your head around the fact that it's it's okay to not play a game when it releases. And that it's okay to just like play what you have and let games finish in development before you get get to them. Oh, look at these oranges. Oh, the are Oh, there's another field event. I don't know if it's coming through on audio. Maybe I'm talking too much, but like they've got a really nice resonance for its beat. Oh, it looks like it is coming through. And you can, yeah, that's, I mean, that's one of the reasons I, I'm kind of generally not into playing demos as well. I'd rather wait until I can access the game full and then, you know, enjoy it. But this one in particular, I have had my eyes on for ages and I, I couldn't resist. Damn it, the mouse isn't a weird... <laughs> the hell of it sounds like Flint sneezing. Um, yeah. And honestly, I've got so many games on my to playlist that adding demos, I, I don't need to add more. I'm trying to uncover all the map because I want to see in case I'm missing something. Yeah. I honestly like the the joy that I'm still getting out of Vintage Story, I want to ride that as long as I can. And if it means that I'm not playing other games that are hot off the press, then that's okay. Though I will absolutely be looking at uh, Nightingale when that drops. <laughs> Just... Because uh, I think I'm getting something for it, so... Oh, I love them. <laughs> it's so cute. Well, good news. We don't have to compete with po Pokemon anymore. Oh, no, <laughs> Beard. How dare you call your bosses and be like, um, I've decided to, to be sick two days early. Yeah, I remember you telling me that, Sam. That's cool. Nightingale's head, yeah. Uh, it was all I could do not to... Again, like, they were like, you can join the stress test. And I was like, Ugh. I think I'll wait.
I mean, curious about these little things that keep popping up, little altars or something. So yeah, I'll probably be playing Nightingale when it drops. <sighs> but I have some really large games on my playlist this year that have been sitting in my my to playlist for a while. Like I want to finish Mass Effect games, the Mass Effect trilogy. If I can, without people trying to help. That is like one of the worst games for backseating. Oh yeah. And then um Lynn got me like the full I toast. Uh, last year, Flint got me like the full edition of Red Dead Redemption, like the premium, fancy, swanky, all the things variant, and I really want to play that too. I love these spunnies so much. I have to, I have to open the map up. I'm, I, I've got to do it. Yeah. I, I, I'm not good at, I don't have the attention span to finish big games, but I want to give it a go. Bunnies. Yeah. Well, I tried it. <sighs> okay, that's good to know. I, I tried it. I tried launching it on Xbox, but I just, I struggle uh, with using the Xbox controller for anything except for driving. Not as big as, see, I still haven't finished that either, Mel. I did finish the one of the DLCs and I was pretty fucking proud of myself for that. But yeah, I did though, like last year, I, I am cursed. <laughs> um, yeah, Toast, this is uh, Odd Sparks, which is due, it's, it is a demo right now. Um, and it is due to be fully released, well, sorry, early access released in April. Last year, I, I had a Discord channel. <laughs> Hi, Drax. <laughs> um, I had a Discord channel last year of games that I wanted to play, and I knocked out a bunch of them. So. I had to. I had to, Drax, and I'm blaming you for it. I, I All I've done is run around the map here and have a meltdown over the Beela fence. That's about it. Like... I have a memory foam footrest or you would have like heard me on camera stomping my feet with like mental squeak. <laughs> I was like, that's so cute. Why? Oh god, I'm lost. Always blame Drax, yeah. A hundred percent. Okay. So yeah, we already just started. <sighs> Did you get yourself some tea for your, your throat drags? So I do have a list of games to play uh, for this year, but it's shorter. But it does include Assassin's Creed, Odyssey and Valhalla, because I still haven't finished them. Oh, for fuck's sake. I just saw what you sent me, Mel. <laughs> I mean... <sighs> is. Well, I, I don't, I'm reading it, I'm just like, usually there's no need to point out as something as obvious, but I guess. You've got beer? Yay! Fucking put put. Okay. I have coffee. I, I forgot to eat before stream, but I'll deal with that later. 
Clinton's live, so I guess I'm t dealing with myself again. I I do have a back a box of dried fruit though. Which did you know? If you open a box expecting it to be nuts, and instead it's sliced dried fruit, it's very alarming visually. It's it's it was more alarming to me. Like you know, if you go to for instance, if you go to get like I'm trying to think of like the that same sort of sense of weird. So like if you went to take a mouthful of of milk but got Sprite instead, like that kind of thing. So. I cleanse my hands with this and I'm like, oh, okay, it's a box of nuts. And then I open it and it's like, oh God, what the fuck? It's, and then I was like, oh, it's just dried fruit. <laughs> yes, beard. Yeah. I was just, when you're not expecting it, dried fruit is alarming. And now I've done, I'm gonna have an apricot. It was very disturbing. They, you know what? There could still be human fingers in there. This could very easily be an ear. They got dark. Beard? Okay. Machines! Shrine usually is capable of making something called a stumpy spark. I mean, we call them farts on this household, but sure. <laughs> stumpy spark. Okay. It wants ether. Oh, I've got a bunch of ether shards. Oh. Well, I really like that with the inventory, it actually shows right here what you need. So you don't have to like. Um, go back and be like, what do I need to put in here? I'm finding this, the, yeah, I, I'm finding the, the fact that my mouse is not aligned with the item and the inventory a bit weird as well. And I don't know if that's because I resized the window or if that's just how it is. But I keep on going to like put something in there, but it goes up into the next square. Okay, so I need, I need logs. Wait, did the music just stop? Oh, you can right click to transfer. Yeah, I d well, I don't know if it was if it was just me. Oh, right click to transfer is a lot easier. Uh, okay, I can't have that. That's interesting. It looks a lot like your normal face, Beard. Beard. They're hardly similar. Yeah. Yeah. 
it, it it's uh they they really made an effort to hide this in the UI. Right, it's right there, bad in the middle. Right in the middle. So to be fair, I only just found that myself, so. Oh shit, that dried apricot was really good. I already had that one, right? I did. I love that mechanic. How the lid like pushes up rather than like a chest lid opening outwards. Oh, all right. We have an ad break coming up in about 30 seconds. I'm assuming I'm okay to take a break here. Um, I would suggest you all do the same and uh, stand up. We get a coffee and I will do the same and I will see you back here in a couple of minutes. And that way none of us miss out anything. I'm going to get a pizza. Okay, look. So we went, we've got this, um, this gross, it's not a grocery store, it's just like a closeout place that we go to sometimes where they, I remember the right word for it. They have basically like things that are, ex, have passed their shelf life, they go and buy in bulk and sell. Not consignment, but it's just like a, a surplus type store, overstock. And, Every now and then you get these really good things like a while back you could, we had these beautiful like chili cheese hand pies 
massive box that we got for five dollars and it had like 60 pastries in there our find last week was a bunch of 7-eleven barbecue chicken pizzas little like individual portions they're really good even like if they're just microwave for for 90 seconds they're actually really good um what is up with the music is the music sporadic All right. We need another shrub. Here we go. I may have to put on own music. Yeah. I really have a froggy throat. How do I... Oh, here. No? I don't know what happened to the bag if it just, like... automatically unpacked. I keep forgetting that I can just uh, turn the camera. For some reason, I keep feeling like this has got a fixed camera. I've lost the hoof flicky. Oh, I'm miles away. Oh. There's a marker right there. <clears throat> okay, and so the chests have a glowing pink gem on them when they haven't been opened. And then... It's not lit up when you've looted it already. I wonder if it'll give me something back. But yeah, they're just like little self single portion crappy gas station pies. <clears throat> but they're or pizzas, but they're actually really good. I'm enjoying them anyway. But the fact that they cook in like 90 seconds makes it perfect as a stream thing, because then you can just like cut it up with a knife and fork, shut up. But then you can just eat it with a fork and it's nice and easy. Man, my throat is so sore. It's doing a chest. Ch test. Oh, look. They've added animation. Words. <gasps> no, he's cute. I love him. Oh. Okay. The strange metal in my staff changes. Oh. Okay. No, look at his. Oh, I should have worn my googly eye earrings. Look at him. <laughs> Okay, yeah, we we going to nuke the um the game music cuz it's not consistent. It's very nice and I love it very much, but I need something consistent because otherwise I get weirded out. Um we will put on What fits this game? 
like probably not like break beats or hard grunge Why do I, I can't remember what I normally put on for uh satisfactory. Actually I usually go for 80s shit for satisfactory, so that probably doesn't work either. Gospel Neo Soul Waltz Solo Instrumental. Here we go. Vocal only. No, no vocal. Shouldn't be a problem. This shouldn't be too, um, distracty. So, I started a single player, <laughs> another single player game of Vintage Story last night, just for science. Um, I started it in Homo sapiens mode. And did what Toast, yeah, we did what Toast talked about. So I put it in Homo sapiens mode, but then turned lore on. And then those mods. <laughs> yeah, the mods. And honestly, very cool. I liked it a lot. The pathing one is very interesting. Okay. <laughs> oh no, that's really cute. He's like, hey. Hopefully you can still hear. Uh, hear his noises over the music. <laughs> no. He's like, wee. Oh no, he just heard us in. <laughs> Why is this so cute? Oh. Okay. Wait. Ancient waypoints are immediately. Oh, okay. So you can move around a bit faster. Of logs. I call them stumpy sparks. Fill a spark slot in the stumpy spark. Oh. Okay. Oh no, I have two. Well. Oh, okay. Just right click on it. Can I make another one? 
I want to make another one. Oh, I don't have enough logs. I love them so much. Oh, he picks them up too. Hey, this is ridiculous. How is this so cute? rolling I don't know if you can see I can't turn the camera in yet he's he's making a stumpy spark <laughs> it's so cute Okay. Who are you? Mm hmm. No. Oh, I've got lost because I turned the map. Oh. Oh, I'm very in the wrong place. Look at this divine research, divine researcher outstanding in their research. Not my job. Oh. Yeah. I love that I have an army of minions now. Oh. What? Oh, okay. Apparently you have to click to exit, you can't just face plant. them so much this is not the way even the spunnies are cute why do why am i not turning the camera why am i here done <laughs> I keep on trying to um when trying to jump doesn't work I think I want the 
Yeah, I want the static compass. There we go. I don't understand. Okay, Mal. Thanks for coming by. And uh, sending me that amazing screenshot. that entertained me far too much feel free to let them know that you showed me that oh okay no i understand i think Mainly because I watched Drake's video. I need to do some more questing for these guys. <clears throat> Sorry, I'll finish stuffing my face on this again. Alright. He's got birch branches in his hair. How do I know that birch? Because I play Vintage Story. Mm -hmm. How do I know I can trust him with sparks? He does. What is it with you and facial hair? He does have good eyebrows, though. Did you did you see those clips that uh, my friend Echo did? <clears throat> That's pretty good. Okay. Wood, stone, and sparks. This is... man. Oh my god, I love so much how they're just like... Wee! Oh no! No, buddy, stop! <laughs> my heart. Okay. The heads aren't strong enough to to break the smaller tre the bigger trees. That's it. You're just gonna bring me one of the logs. So rude. And you want four sparks. <laughs> it's so cute! Yes, my stumpy army grows.
I'm just waiting. Oh, my hat. Let's start here. Oh, so I had, um, I met with uh, the uh, college students from MSU yesterday morning um, who were doing, using my stream as a class project. And they're, they're already amazing people. I'm very excited to see what they come up with. They were full of ideas and they clearly knew what Twitch was, which helps. Man, this is gonna get out of hand really fast. Um, but yeah, it was it was good. They asked a bunch of pertinent questions and Wait, can I get them to... Where did, where did you put them? Oh, they were... They did bring them to me. That's amazing! Wait, what? A chaos crafty corner? For, I, I don't understand. I mean, yes, but I don't know what that means. been to where do I get stone from period of time to pretend I mean that I feel <laughs> I feel like we do that already but yes that sounds like something we can do we can work on that wait right, get back out there What is that? Oh, all right. This is amazing. I love I love this so much.
How am I supposed to wait until April for this? Look, handy games. Poke a girl up. I can't, don't make me wait till April. Please. I wonder if you mentioned that in Discord, Luna. What uh, people would think you meant. Oh, wait. No, hey. I could hibernate until April. I, I mean, I'm, I'm always open to ideas, Luna. Oh no. Two whole months. The first month will go into your eyebrows, sir. Mm -hmm. Elephant corpses. Okay, so it shows like a dependency there. Oh, that's really clever. I really like the visual. So doing that one enabled that one which enables that one. Or is it the other way around? No, oh, I think it's the other way around. Oh, you can see the path. <clears throat> okay, so we need to go see the quartermaster. Stumpy Sparks. Where do they think I am? A spark dealer? like that sound. More sparks so I can make more sparks. Thank you. 
love how they like hit things and get stars on their eyes. Oh. Oh. I didn't expect that to happen. Oh, what's this? So they just go for like the nearest thing. Interesting. The sounds also make me think of Spore a little bit. struggling a little bit with the camera mo movement but I'll get that I love that they just like roll backwards and forwards on the pressure plate there I'm curious how much content I'm going to get out of three hours of gameplay. How many can I have? All of them. The more you have, the more you can gather. <laughs> okay. I can make a barrel and a path. Huh. Huh? Build a logger. Collect it to the shrine. Ooh, here we go. Now we're getting into the... The stuff. Build a logger. to rotate okay stones are in the way oh does it matter 
I think it does. Oh, game says, oh, okay. It snaps onto trees. And then connect. Access the path tool via the build menu. Oh, that's really cute. Oh, did I not connect it properly though? No, now I need to, uh, hang on. Uh. Oh my god, yes. Amazing. <laughs> I love this so much. Okay, why can't Satisfactory be more cute? Why can't we have lizard doggos doing this? Oh my, I love this so much. I'm gonna run out of ether shards. Oh, so I just oh, already use this one ether shard at a time, doesn't it? Oh, is the output full? better than convey about can't do a lot tries hard good listener <laughs> and me I'm a spunky, uh, uh, a stumpy spark.
All right. Okay, we have 11 sparks now. I'm worried I'm going to run out of the etheric stuff. So I have 13. That's good. I want to make sure I've got the spear. Whoopsie. Whoa. Jesus Christ. My mouth drifted off the uh, game screen. Oh no, look at them go! I'm following. Mm -hmm. Deliver a hundred logs. Okay. We can do that. Oh, the way they waddle just makes me so happy. Okay, do maybe do I need another harvester? curious what it's going to do there. If they're going to pick up from there or there. Yes, but this is a problem. What is that? Oh. Okay, so <laughs> that doesn't work. Thank you. 
We can have two different inputs. Wait, where are you going with that? So really... No, that didn't work. What I ought to be doing here is... Wait. Right. trying so hard hmm. all right 20 40 60 so we're pretty close handy being able to just like take out a piece of road there I think each full load is 20 okay Love them. Ah. Uh. smart oh pretty because I keep on smashing the heads on walls because I keep making them smash their heads on walls This is so interesting, this like visual quest log. Raining party! What do you mean? Hello, streamer bite. There we go. <laughs> hi, hello, hi Soma, hi Bakma. Wine. Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to possibly the cutest fucking game ever. Thanks, Bakma. Look at these little guys. Uh, I love them. I like how you send them off and they're like, wee! Why, thank you so much for the raid. Welcome in, everyone. Hello, before I get, like, absorbed. Hi, I'm Del, or Deloria, and uh, my pronouns are she, her, and I'm currently looking at the Old Sparks demo, uh, which is available. Hi, Molly. Um, it is available on Steam right now as part of the next first thing. I don't normally do demos because I'm really grumpy and impatient, but I had to. I had to. Uh, um, yeah, thank you for, for the raid. <laughs> um, I don't know what I'm doing, but that's okay. This. Right? 
this. I think. I have an army of cuteness and it's it's just oh it's killing me. Oh, I need 20 logs. All right. That's easy. So like the roads are like conveyor belts. This is basically just like if some oh. It's going to give the same hit as Satisfactory in some ways, but it's so much fucking cuter. Hey, look at look at this. Hang on. Let me find a tree that I can see in the back. Look like, whoo My heart. It cannot take the adorableness. Okay. Refiner. Oh lord. Whoa. Whoa, look how wobbly it is. I have concerns. Oh, okay. So this can take two inputs as well. Interesting. And I think we'll... There. Oh, there's a tree in the way. Well, that's inconvenient. to you sparks <laughs> it's so cute This one's like, buddy. Oh. Oh. There. Like the sword, like the wood shavings is amazing. Are amazing. But I love that they activate things just by like rolling backwards and forwards on a switch. Like they're face rolling to craft. I see. It's it's so good. The enthusiastic Whee! I've never played Pikmin. It 
That's so cute. My my little heart is just like doing a struggle. Oh no, you said doobers, and now I'm thinking about doozers from Fraggle Rock. Okay. So what am I doing now? What am I working on? I don't know what I'm doing. Spark creation, Woodcraft 101. Oh, here we go. Alright, I think that'll <laughs> I love it. That'll that'll do. How where's the out? I have, I have some sawn, yeah, I've got some timbers. I don't know what other ones there are. I only really saw the little wood, wood dudes, little stumpy dudes. And I was just like, uh, yes. Don't forget to drink some water. Just like plants, you need hydration too. Fine, I will. You too. Also, please, please, if you need to go do like post stream self care, please, please do so. Oh, it's the mirror. Okay, here we go. The elephant. <laughs> Oh, these are things that I found. I don't like them. Too many legs, too many eyes. Creepy. This is like the handbook. Oh, okay. We've got storage barrels. How did I not see that before? I feel like I'm missing something here. Oh, create a quest over you. This should. I just done holy shit so this is this is kind of like the tears I guess on satisfactory but you've got these quest chains that unlock one thing to the other I was just like, oh. I'm not, I'm not quite sure. I 
I'm still a little bit lost. Oh, look at that. You can see the the roads on the map. Whoopsie. Ah, uh, stop it. Notebook. Okay, let's let's simplify that a little bit before I get overwhelmed. Oh, I broke it. Complete the following quest first. Spark creation and woodcraft 101 completed. Have I done something wrong? Oh, wait, wait, wait a minute. I think I... I have a think. Funky. It so is. Like, I re everything references Fire Rock. I'm a cow, so like, moo or whatever. Yeah, exactly. I feel like that's uh, a good reward for their service. Maybe I got ahead of myself here. Also, uh, today I have some sad news to share with you all. Um, I hope you're all sitting down or standing as, as you can be comfy. Um, but we can no longer have the stabby hooker tag on Twitch. apparently decided that Stabby Hooker is offensive and uh, I'm not allowed to use it anymore. Uh, but rest assured, I will always be a Stabby Hooker to you. I'm not entirely sure if it was the Stabby part or the Hooker part. Because a Hooker is a position in rugby. I don't know. No, no, they can't. They, no one will be able to part me from my hooker's handbag dexterity plus two. Oh, here we go. It's right here, my hooker's handbag. What is in a hooker's handbag, you might ask? Well, many people say it's rude to ask what, what's inside a handbag. Books. Yes. I mean, I, I get it. It could absolutely be misconstrued in a, a an offensive way. 
Um, but yes. So I was like, well... Well, I mean, the thing is that the, the, the reason the joke was entertaining was because of the miscon misconstruing. So I, it was perhaps in poor taste. Hmm. Um, so I, I can understand why they did it, but yes, no longer using the tag. I didn't even read what he said. <laughs> The spawn height. Wait. <laughs> oh, 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 right. All right. I I don't even hear. I don't even pay attention. Oh. Mm -hmm. Yes, I did forget what you wrote because I didn't read it. Oh, I didn't really forget it so much as not pay attention. <sighs> Wait. Oh, okay. I need more. <laughs> Thanks. We had a good run. We'll just have to come up with something else. I must say, it definitely got people being like, what is that? What is... What is... Debbie Herbert? Okay, I feel like we can probably... <laughs> Krabby Hooker? Mm. I am definitely Krabby. Oh wine human asked me, why can't we have nice things? Ah, wine human, the sad truth is we supernatural beings often destroy nice things without realizing it. Like when I accidentally transformed the parlor into a nest for my bat friends. Mortals like yourself, however, perhaps it's just a penchant for chaos. Bat. Bat. I love those so much. <laughs> Thank you, wine. <laughs> So good. That. <laughs> okay. Oh, I just realized something here. If I move... Oh, no, that's not going to work. But if I made a more direct path... They would move faster. Punky Pink Cow asked me, what's a good cheeky Twitch tag for someone doing crochet? Oh. In the wild expanse of creative streaming, one might observe the clever use of hooked on yarn as a most fitting and cheeky Twitch tag for a crafter deftly weaving magic with crochet hooks. Well, thanks, Punky. And David. I mean, that's pretty cute. And pretty clever. Hooked on yarn. I find those so interesting. Oh, wait, later on, once I finish with the demo, we're gonna of this game. We're gonna be trying, I'm gonna be doing a, a thing for uh, a dare drop thing, but this time it's not a game. It's a piece of software called Powder, which 
uses machine learning to analyze your Twitch VODs and extract moments that would be good clips. So it looks for volume changes or extra interaction and chat and stuff to try and like find those good those good moments. Um yeah, so I I analyzed basically if you sign up you so I signed up for a free trial, a free month. Um the pricing is pretty uh obstructive. <laughs> like I wouldn't I wouldn't pay for it. I don't <laughs> I don't have the means for that. But the trial is is good. And if I do the the this clip for Deirdrop, then I get an extra three months. Um prohibitive is the word I was looking for. Um I did go through and have a look at the terms of service and the privacy policy, and I'm satisfied with the way that they deal with my content. As in, my content remains mine. And derivative works are mine. Well, there are no derivative works. It's just my stuff. That's the important thing. Um, so because it takes some system resources, I, I tested it last night just to check. Um, so I've already analyzed the VOD, but I haven't seen what it's giving me. So we're going to look at that on stream, but it's already picked up one thing as being full of lots of laughter and chat. Um, I can't remember the particulars. The company themselves is based in Paris, so they have to meet the GDPR um, and all the EU regulations, which kind of helps. And they said that they, the, tr the training materials are all ethical. I can't remember what the exact words are, that's me paraphrasing. But someone did ask them, like, what's the deal with, how do you train the machine learning? And they did have an answer for that. Um, I don't know all the ins and outs there. Um, what, what do they say? Uh, We historically used a mix of publicly available data sets and recorded data ourselves to train the AI. We comply with GDPR regulations as we're in Paris and we have an ethics advisor that we work with on a regular basis. I, I don't know if that answers the question. So, but they're, they're not generating content, they're providing a search within your own content on top of what they've got from the learning. But the uh, the staff have been very patient in asking many questions. Um I said the biggest reassurance for me is that they're based in the EU because their legislation is so much more strict than it is in the States. Um, but yeah, nothing like the privacy policy at all. I know that's something that a lot of people concern, are concerned about. And it, I, I always read these things, even though I have limited understanding, I guess, of some of the legalese, but I was comfortable with it. Beforehand, I've had been offered contracts uh, for brands, and I've had two that I've turned down because they wouldn't remove licensing thing. Yeah. Um, like it was there was one contract that I was offered, and they were like, "We we want license to use your content in perpetuity," and I'm like, "No." <laughs> they were offering me like a twenty five dollar product. And I'm like, you want to use my license forever for 25 bucks? No, I don't think so. <laughs> One company turned around and said, yes, okay, we will take that out. So they actually removed that from the, the contract. But another one was like, we won't do it. And I'm like, bye. <laughs> See you later. Yeah. 
It was just... But the number of people who, like, just don't read contracts, and there were... So, like, I was looking at other people's concerns, and a lot of... A lot of people were jumping on the hysteria bandwagon. Like, there are absolutely big concerns about the way that it's used, but it's a tool. And it's out there, whether we like it or not. So it pays to learn about the, what you can and get some form of understanding. So we'll see how it pans out. But that's basically, that's what we're doing today. We're going to be using this program that uses machine learning to try and pick out good clips. Uh, Flynn said he's already had good luck with his. So, but we're going to do that after I've finished with this game. And I'm going to try and get the demo's worth. I need... Oh, ether shards. Oh, wait, I need to... We need to kill the... These guys. No, not that, that. <laughs> Those sound effects. My concern with that is basically someone, you know, someone using my content for ill. Making me say things that are stuff that I wouldn't say. Interesting, if you just toss it out there, they just like... Oh god, it's on a rampage! part about this is one of the things that I struggle with especially when you do like you know like nine ten hour streams is it's really hard to go through and try and get clips and people do a, a great job of clipping but there's always that thing that one thing that might have been missed or that whatever and and so if I do this this one thing for Dare I, for Deirdre, if I get an extra three months, so that's four months of a tool to help me make content that I can then share to other places and diversify. I think that should be interesting. Uh, are we listening to? Drink a little star? Hunky. Ah. Uh, I don't know how to answer that question. I'm okay. That's probably what it is. It's cute. I like it. I wanted something that wasn't very intense for this game. And the game music for this is very... Uh, short and repetitive. Thank you, Buckma. Should have seen that coming.
Oh, whoa. Whoa, that moved. Look, there's stars reflected in the telescope. I've made it process agnostic. Oh, oh. More sparks. Hey, look. It showed what was in there. In the box. Oh my god, that's amazing. What a fucking fantastic. It's so simple and totally unnecessary. But amazing. I love it, I love it, I love it. What a cool detail. Okay. Okay. Dude, a spark workbench. Do that already? Um... What is that button? Tools. Wait, what is that? What is that? Edit tool. Relocate and destruct it. Okay. But am I not turtly enough for the turtle club? I 
Hi, Echo. I don't understand how this works. Like, select. I'm gonna just go over here instead. everything I need, right? I don't know if I'm doing a dumb or not. My oh, must be built on an ancient base. Fuck's sake. Okay, not doing a dumb. Just doesn't paying attention. Oh god, that's so far away! <laughs> Whatever! Bring me the corpse of your siblings. Eggs. There's <laughs> so many of them. Okay, so now we are doing this. Perfect. I love this so much. Look at them. Have we got a bit of a traffic jam here? <laughs> yes! Look at them waddling along! Alright. Oh, actually, I need two of them back. Scotty, this is Odd Sparks. It is currently available as a demo, but it releases on um, April 24. Uh, and it is so cute that I am struggling to contain myself. I don't. I am 
feeling pricey. Oh, there we go. Is that gonna work? I don't think it is. So why... Why can't I delete that one? Uh, probably because it's the original one that they put down. I mean, how could I not? Look at these adorable little fuckers. Seriously. Oh, boo. It is. Look, look, wait, wait for this, Scotty. Hang on. Appropriate reaction. It's just, it's amazing. Guys, look, pick that up. It's, it's just too much. Okay, so I don't think I've quite figured out. How the barrels work. Oh, wait, you mind. <laughs> yes. We haven't done a proper grocery shop in months. Just because we can just it's just so much. We basically we'll like wait until we run out of whatever essential and then we just go to the store and we get that particular thing and then that's it. Yeah, see that's the thing, Echo. You need you need things fixings for coffee. Um, and that, that's important. It's taking a bit to get used to the camera and the navigation, but I like it. Which button to push? Okay, so now the mirror has a question. I feel like the mayor is being deliberately obstructive at this point. Like, it's really dangerous for you to be out in the woods. I need you to go out 
into the woods and do a lot of stuff to prove that you can go out into the woods and do a lot of stuff. I think I need to add another Arvester. What do I need? How do I get them thingers? Oh, corpses, right? The Beelefin corpses? I just want there was they only seem to appear on the dirt mounds, maybe? Aha, here we go. I got the thingy I need. So now we can get some whoopsie. We can get the another log thingy going. They're beela fence. And they are so fucking adorable, it's just illegal. So basically, like in terms of satisfactory, we're using the paths and the um, the the little stumpy dudes is an alternative to alternative to convey about. Oh, we had a traffic jam again. Okay. We got some with the air. Combine them into one storage thing? I don't think we can. Either 
the thing. I'm going around in circles. All right. That's working. Pay for build. Oh. Okay, good luck. Hmm. So apparently you need like a little bit of... There we go. A little bit of road for them to walk on. All right, how many do I need? Sawn timber? Oh, this, this is easy. I love when you drop one on the path, everyone's just like, oh, look, you're holding up the line, but could you move? Would you, would you mind? So good. Are they moving faster now? Oh my God, I love this so much. They're going faster. I probably need to yank a couple off the saw line, saw mill line actually. I think that'll do. All right. I'm curious how sometimes they seem to like hear off. I'm just like, is that a... If they're within a certain proximity, will they attack things?
Oh god, they are, they're rampaging. Oh, its eyes are glowing. Oh god. Oh, I think we just... It just ate our... <laughs> well, we just lost our first sparks. <laughs> they got eaten by spunnies. Oh, okay. Okay. So forest spunnies are different to field spunnies. Good to know. Twenty forty. Okay, so we've got that. That is true. It'd be really nice if there was a. An auto sort. Everyone knows. I mean, they're not like spunnies from Antioch, though. So that's that's something. Someone's just like, I got nothing to do. Come on, come on now. Forty sparks. Have I got that yet? I have forty sparks and sixty timber. I feel really bad that I got got them killed. <sighs> I would have been disappointed in myself if I hadn't picked up on that. I have yet to encounter a holy hand grenade, but hey, it's early days. Mm -hmm. uh oh, hang on. Oh, wait, wrong person. Give me that back. You can't have those. Also, in character creation, you get to pick what your cape looks like, and I think that's really cool. Forty sparks, sixty timber. There, I told you I could do it. Ah. She says that after challenging me. Okay. So. Distiller shrine. Crafty spot. Okay, um, Woodsman and Divine Researcher. I'm curious if the game's gonna get mad at me because I've already got a head with the Divine, the, mm -hmm. the teleport thing. Uh-huh. Wait, did that say Mantis? Mm -hmm. Etheric pellets. Oh, I've got those. <laughs> I 
and it claims you have now been registered as user. You can teleport from anywhere to any active waypoint by the map. That's not... I, I took the... Fi ah! Stop that. And they said the woodsman had a quest? Here. Mm -hmm. Uh, yes. Mm -hmm. Build a saw bench, deliver saw and timber. Oh, so it is giving you credit for what you've done already. That's nice. All right. I feel I feel naked running around without my sparks. There we, that's better. Okay, so we need another saw bench. the music. No, I didn't. I just can't hear it. Uh... The thing is, you've only got one output from each logging factory. and group retrieval. I don't know what the control does. Interesting. Uh, okay, so we need a harvester. What do we need? Oh. Hmm. What is this making? More sparks? We could pause this, I guess. So a saw bench, build, refiner. go over here there there 
we go. Wow, those barrels hold a lot. Oh, we have ads popping. <laughs> Whoops. Never mind. <laughs> oh, we are in ads. Um, so <laughs> I I am gonna take a quick fire break. I got distracted. I'll be back uh, when my ads are over. Okay, I can't remember what we were doing. What was I doing? It's been like two seconds. Oh, I was going to reconnect this. Build roads. to the woodsman. Sawn timber. One, two, three, four, five. Mm hmm. Hmm. Oh, oh, that's so cool. talk to the the researcher first oh. Oh. unlock an ancient shrine all right hey buddy mm. some field spunnies hmm. oh i got you oh yeah no we really learned the lesson about about forest spunnies oh lord i've got a bunch of quests now I'm already at that point where 
I would be in Satisfactory in other games where I'm like, right, time to tear it all down and restart. <laughs> Not that there's a lot to tear down, but. <laughs> Good night, Drax. Thanks for popping in. Right. Oh man, it's a shame you can't use those. Okay, so... Oh boy. Oh dear. God, you're killing me here. Okay. So this is the teleport. This is the one that's just going to fuel the teleporter. I can reroute that to get more sparks if I want. 
Now we need some refiners. really is going to end up like satisfactory. So that's timber, that's timber, that's panels. So what do you got? One, two, three. Whoa! Auto save starter. Oh, this is getting so familiar now. Look, it's even got a rate, a production rate. up being like screws and satisfactory all over again isn't it So I really need to find another ele oh need to find another one so we can get another refiner going I think how are we doing slowly so slow
Well, I could redirect this into... There we go, that should get them going for a little while. Um, I don't want to get the sparks going here too, actually, still. I guess I don't need to have that connected to anything though. Okay, so this is making, look, we're going into this. This is making seven and a half units per minute. And that's 15. So that does need, the assembler needs two refiners. It really is satisfactory. I love this so much. We need an auto sort for the inventory. Heck, I, I didn't refill my coffee. Oh my god, this is amazing. Okay, so what else have I got going on here? Okay, so... Wooden boards. No, wooden panels, wooden panels. Yeah, my coffee's broken. production rates and I love it like can I overclock it <laughs> I want to overclock my, my my sparks <laughs> where's some slugs Overclocking is just adding more, more. Look, it's a tier three, a, a Mac three belt now. Okay. I'm guessing at some point you get faster roads. Yeah. I love how they're like little shuffle like waiting at the end there. Okay, that's that's going better. There we go. Whoopsie. This is on your list, Molly. The the list of games that you don't need more of. Oh. Are we getting traffic jams? Look at that. Look, somewhere different. <laughs> no, but it's so cute. And and there's 
his combat and it's cute and it, there's numbers and it's cute. I was like stomping my feet before because it was too too adorable and I was struggling to process. Because having a shorter belt makes it more efficient. Look at my minion army. Yes. All right. What am I doing? Nope. Not that. Nope. Not that either. Nope. Not that. This. There. Okay. Okay. So I'm working on that one. And that one. This can be accepted at Woodland Shrine. What's that? Wait. That's a Woodland. Would, mm, would that be a Woodland Shrine or would that? Oh, there's a dark forest. I love how it shows on the map here. I think we've got to go up there. Okay, so now we know. Don't pick on the... Their eyes glow when they aggro. Uh, whoop. The, the spunnies are, are no joke if you're uh you fuck around and find out all right what's this over here giant tree ancient shrine Crafty spark, but it's broken. Okay. Have I got those? I don't, because I just put them away. I don't know what a crafty spark is. A, a spark that's crafty, I guess. I'm now scared of forest spooters. I'm gonna take those. <clears throat> oh. I've got a bunch with empty hands. What are you putting out? 60 per minute. I don't know what the uh, the rate of transfer transfer is for a stumpy spark. Now I feel like I'm getting ready to set up a coal factory and I'm making sure that the coal is staying at level. Okay. So 
Well, let's just top this one up. Whoopsie. Have I got too much here? it up from the other side of the road. Okay. I think it was up this way. I have a feeling I'm good. Yeah, I was going to say I'm going to get more than three hours of content out of this. I've already been streaming it for over three hours and I don't think I've got anywhere in. spark waves at you eager and ready to receive instructions okay What's what's so great about a crafty spark then, huh? Oh, they've got little arms. Oh my goodness. Playlist. Um H? H does not open Oh. Okay, that was uh, R Q B. M. Fuck's sake. Whoop. Hey, it was literally flashing at me. So stumpy sparks are more efficient, less offensive, and more efficient. Oh, is that a rate of transfer? Oh no, that's how long it takes to make a stumpy spark. Okay. <laughs> We're the grumpy looking bunch, but they seem like they enjoy working hard. Double tips. Oh, okay. So we really need Are we taking it this way? We are. I 
I do get splitters at some point and I feel like that's gonna help a bunch. What does that do? Oh! Okay. I just don't, I don't entirely know what the control does. So if we bring it up here... save. were you playing today simulation city and factory streaming <gasps> were you playing this have you tried this yet welcome in this is oh my god this is so cute i just can't even um oh, it's so good like i'm not gonna go into details but there's been like a couple of points where I'm like, yeah, this is cute. And then all of a sudden it's like, oh, snap. And then I'll get on a little further and then I'll be like, oh, shit, okay. And then all of a sudden it's gone from cute game to being like, hmm, production rates. Interesting. Well, I hope you had a fun stream today. Welcome in, by the way, and, and thank you for the raid. Um, Hello. Hi, I'm Del Deliria. Uh, my pronouns are she, her. Uh, I am also doing the demo thing. Um, And checking out Odd Sparks, which apparently only has three hours of content. And I'm at three and a half hours. So. Yeah. Um, so I'm trying to clear a path right now <clears throat> um, to make another factory. You do. So you can put them on paths, which makes them like conveyor belts, or you can command them manually. To go and chop a tree or that one already. Yeah. 
And it's adorable. Um, and they will, they don't just collect and gather, they will fight as well. So I've got like a little thing here from getting logs from the trees down into a saw bench, which puts out seven and a half units per minute of lumber, which then goes into this bench here, which is set to wooden panels, makes 15 per minute. That's probably going to be a little familiar to you with with the games that we play. Um, but there's also quite a, a cute story to go along with it too. That can be a bit to figure out the UI. Here we go. It's, it's, I am, I am thoroughly enjoying this. It's huge. Like for a, a demo, this map is enormous. Okay. Oh, do I have another? Ah, oh, really? Nine? And you've got like teleport points. It's, uh, my heart. They've, they've done a really good job with it. This is one that I've been watching for a while. Um, especially when I saw that it was Handy Games putting it out because I've always really enjoyed their games. And I'm not disappointed. Wait, who do I... Who, do, who does this... <laughs> Who's, who wants this? That is the quartermaster. Okay. Okay, so now I here splitters. Conveyor belt splitters. That's gonna make life a lot easier. Wooden blade. Oh guys. <clears throat> oh, okay, that's interesting. Oh, what's that? The crossing is fascinating. Built on a junction, sparks will only move forward pa oh yes took a little while to understand it but yes all right um let's go kill some bunnies But not forest winds, because the forest winds are scary. Okay, five more. Uh, I 
think the stumpy ones are better. I learned my lesson with those ones. Oh, I still need the... The path here. Oh, this is... Uh, the music is from Epidemic. The music in this was really cute. Um, but it was... Limited. So I, I picked up a... I scraped a, a little playlist on Epidemic to... Are you a you're a field one? Wait, what is that? Oh god. Oh no. What is it? A mantis stag? Oh, fuck that. <laughs> nope. Very, very, no. Oh, you're chopping a tree. Hurry, buddy. Alright. So this is going to make the crafty sparks. So I need to get... A path set up to bring... Stumpy sparks and wooden panel. Wait, can I just out of curiosity? Can't oh, delete it. I wonder if I don't have to keep it there. Maybe I can just build one closer to... where everything else is. Boop! They, they really are. Okay. Er... Back workbench. Oh, what if I do? Hmm. So you can only build the spark workbenches on these little like purple squares. I said it was satisfactory, but cute. Hey. Timberborn? Honestly, it's more like satisfactory than anything else. Um, for me, anyway, so far, like how you've got your 
input and output rates in setting tables to make different items. Um. So you want to get a... like that and then like that So that's going to be Oh, are you not going to let me do that? Ah, okay, I guess I have to I'm getting ahead of myself. I'm getting ahead of myself. I've got to make a st I've got to make the spark first before I know how to make the spark. So this will do. <laughs> we'll just manual craft it so that I know how to make. Do I get I get the recipe? There and. All right. Why are limbs so difficult to make? Oh, look at them. So on the other machine, the stumpy sparks just like roll backwards and forwards. These guys. <laughs> adorable <laughs> they do bongo cat I wish I could zoom in closer. Okay. Do I have a quest to make a certain number of those long dudes? Okay, so I'm gonna go back to him and then we're good. Oh, buddy. That's fine. Could probably do it some more. You can pick them up yourself, but it's far more entertaining. To, uh, do yourself. Uh, uh, to make the little minions do it. Um, merchants down here. 
Oh. 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 And a bailiff fence. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. This merchant is risky, man. Oh, we need to go see the researcher. Oh, crap. Sure. Um, what time is it? Eight o'clock. Okay. It, I need to switch over to, uh, another thing, but I'm going to come back to this. Um, I kind I don't want. I mean, I could just do it tomorrow. Could I just do it tomorrow and keep on playing? I didn't commit to doing it. Oh, did we run out of music already? We did. Oh dear. This was supposed to be a 300 trick sound list. Sound tracks. That's 300 trick playlist. Okay, I'm just gonna do the other thing tomorrow because I'm enjoying myself. I don't wanna. I don't wanna stop. I'm having fun. Okay. Right. So we need to make some crafty sparks. Wait, do I move faster on roads? I also just realized that there's another node up here. There's two more up here. Stumpy Sparks. I love their little hands. Okay, I think what I might do here... Oh, can I... 
Can I do that? I don't know if I can do that. Oh, no, we've been through this before. It needs some distance. I don't think that is going to work. Oh, but what if I... Mm, got that. Oh, but I put it in the wrong place again, didn't I? Oh, actually, maybe it'll let me do it. thing for sure yeah why not I I don't tend to do um the the demos because I already deal with decision paralysis. <laughs> it's, it's like I don't I don't need to make it worse. This was on my list beforehand. And like when I suggested it to Drax, I was like, Urgh. and then after watching his VOD, I'm like, oh fuck, I need this one. I'm just going to leave them to it. I just said, this is only supposed to have three hours of content. I've been live for over four hours and I don't think I've even got near to it really. This is the demo. Um, I did get it th from Keymailer, but it's, I'm pretty sure it's the same version that everyone else has. I've done it again. Another ad break. I'm gonna go fix my broken coffee. And, uh... I'll stop playing this.
Okay. I'll be right back. All right, I have fixed the broken coffee. This is a very long belt. Oh, so the other cool thing about this... Wait, why are you carrying a log? Um... Is... The worlds are generated by seed. I guess every map is different. transporting the wrong things <sighs> I am sending the wrong things Oh. 
All right. So now we want... God, what have I done? Ah! So I can't take out the big trees yet. So first of all, we've got that coming to here. And then we have Oh my god, they sound so alarming. So we want this to go... Over here. So that is planks and stumpy sparks input. So now we need logs. Whee! So we're going to do. Oh, there we go. I'll just top you over the air. Um I wonder if I could split one of these. How is this going? That's almost okay, those have full hoppers. Okay, so we can't do that one. I'm gonna do a splitter.
I'm gonna have to cross that. Alternate way. Okay, so I didn't. You need to rotate this here. Here we go. Except you're not going anywhere. back with a plank. <laughs> oh, are you full? Okay, fine. Alright, so that's logs. I have to trust the process. Now it's starting to to look like something.
<laughs> That's so cute. Oh. So we need more on on this path. thing is that basically once this is full they'll just carry on delivering down the rest of the next path just swap out some of the returning crafty boys here this guy I may have lifted a bunch that I didn't mean to, but... How are we doing here? so much. Okay. All right, let's go turn on my army of crafty sparks. <laughs> so glad now I don't have broken coffee. I can't remember who I was giving this to. The researcher? I think it's the researcher. that I'm so cute so much very cute mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Star Trek a demo oh yeah oh. that's that's one I've been looking at for a little while what do you reckon I 
think you like. Oh. I might. I might. Try it on Saturday. It wasn't me. I didn't do it. I mean, that's fair. I would too. Well, I thought, I don't, I don't know. I haven't tried it yet. All I know is that it's loud. That's it. <laughs> From what Beard said. Um, but I was saying I might I might try it on today because today is truck day anyway. So do like our usual Yes. He, he's made it clear that it is a loud game. Um so normally on Saturdays I, I do ATS or ETS uh with my friend. But I can only play for a few hours with the wheel. So maybe after that I can check out Star Tracker. I don't want to go hunting elephant. It's very... Hey, Beard, is it loud? Where can I find an elephant? Sorry, a beelephant. I know I found some, but fucked if I remember where. Okay, we're gonna go scouting. Actually, I'll just loot the corpse. see these guys when I first went around. The mantis stags make me very uncomfortable. Oh, here's one. Oh, I don't know if four is going to be enough. No. <laughs> okay. Yeah, no, fear, buddy. Good job. Well, they they could have gone better. But, but that's that's okay. I like how you can like your little character can like 
jump up cliffs just fine. But the roads have got to go on hills. Well, I was supposed to do something else this evening, but I don't want to stop playing this. So... Yeah. About that. It's very cute. Big recommend. Big recommend. Like there is a level of complexity in it that I wasn't expecting. There's also story, which, well, I knew to expect that from from what I'd seen from Drax's video, but I didn't expect Look at this. These are little walking tree stumps. And the world gen is based on seed, so that makes it more interesting. No, but it's Bakuma, it's good. It's like, look, back at ya. Is story is like the tu the tutorial is framed as a story with engaging characters. Yeah, that's right. I can spray you back. I keep forgetting about it. The water, it's probably a bit musty smelling at this point. Sorry, Bakma. I know. But it's been a while since I got to use my spray bottle. I dare. And no Ada to be like, collect this artifact. Or I will guilt trip you. <laughs> well, I've learned my lesson. Thanks, Bachman. I I had a, a question at some point for you, Bachman, but it's not urgent. Nor is it related to Satisfactory or Banana Cats. Or spray bottles. Um, also, you can just like go up cliffs. You don't need to jump. You just go. What, what else is there? Fuck's sake, Del. Oh. Uh, I don't think I'm ready to kill Beelephants yet. Wait, I need to make knives. Wait, can I? A wood workshop. Can I arm the sparks? That said it used planks and boards, right? So let's pop you over here. Um, 
No, I was curious about... Um... Project, the, the reset on Project Zomboid servers. Because every time I restart our Project Zomboid server, it resets everything. But then I noticed in the logs that Project Zomboid servers there get rebooted every day, and obviously that's not a problem. It doesn't wipe, but it resets um Welcome back. It resets some of the game settings. Um so it resets the zombie spawns. Which is weird, like the behavior where it prevents things from... It's like it's restarting the spawn cycle. I can't quite describe it. Basically, if you, you know, you, once you clear out an area and respawn is turned off, that should be it. And I think it's because the server is not shutting down, so it's not saving. But I'm not sure. An item from... Oh, at the store? Okay, so that makes me feel a bit better. Like, I saw that it was an issue, but... Like, every time... Like, we had a bug, so I had to, like, restart the server. And then I had to go through and, like, manually clear the areas around everyone's homes again. And it's like... It's not urgent or anything. I was just, like, wondering if that was a thing. It's pretty frustrating, so I feel like probably would have mentioned been mentioned. Oh, the look, the slight changes. It's like a crossing. It's so cute. Okay, we're making blades. Just, just was saying, I was wondering if there's like a command that I can do at each, each session where I can just like force it into a save state or something so that if I do need to restart it. But I, I don't know the wording raining on. I, I feel like it's something I should be able to do, but I'm not entirely sure. What? 
that makes sense. I could, I mean, I could ask, um, I should just ask the server host, I should ask, ask Blue Fang if they have a way to set it up so that it stops before, like, saves before it stops. Because they're pretty good people, like, they're very tolerant of my millions of questions. So I probably should have asked them rather than you out first I feel like that's what's happening though is it's just not saving so like at one point Pyro said some of his containers had been reset and you know things were respawning oh. I don't know Yeah. They might be able to tell me how to do it. I don't mind learning if there's something that they can be like, hey, why didn't you uh, try this? I'll be like, okay. There is no more ancient train. Okay, I guess I'll go up there. I think I got ahead of myself. Yeah, I can do stuff from console. That water is so... I just want to get in the water. The shrine is locked. Fancy. Ooh. Oh, Echo. What the heck? My brain instantly noped out on that. might just taste like oak but the the disconnect between chocolate being something that's supposed to be creamy and sparkling water that's supposed to be like fizzy yeah like I can't even handle yoohoo because it's not it doesn't have the right texture for me That's, that's a something. I think I broke the game. I got ahead of myself. Oopsie. Oh. 
Oh shit. I hate these things so much. No, it's it's not. It's it's not chocolate milk. It's it's bottled, but it's like uh it is a chocolate drink. It's like like someone made chocolate milk but with like super slim and what I can't remember what that like low fat milk is. Oh, okay, that's useful. Thank you, Bakma. That's probably what I need. Is it is it thickened? It feels like it's made with um like the mouthfeel of it, just skim. Makes it makes it feel like it's been made with skim milk. It's very similar to me now to having coffee without creamer, even non-dairy creamer. It just doesn't have the right mouthfeel. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, I can't really handle the full percentage milk, but I, I do anyway. I think I broke the trial. Thanks, Bakma. I appreciate you. Hmm. I think I wasn't supposed to, um, I've unlocked the second shrine, which is the one here. <sighs> but, uh, it's not showing as having been unlocked. No rewards. You get no rewards. Oh, it says you can be fine there around birch trees. Okay. So there's only one quest I can work on right now. It's funny, like coffee. I don't like co I I don't like coffee with milk anymore because it, I have that same thing. It just like doesn't have the right mouthfeel. Um, it's got I've got to have creamer even if it like I'm just used to like non dairy creamer. Yeah. I never, I never thought that would be a thing. <laughs> it's, it's like, it's not that I'm a coffee snob. It's just that it's not delicious without creamer anymore. could try and bump up production here. Oh, 
Yeah, Mako. Oh my god. Babe, condensed milk is like a weakness of mine. Oh man, I love dates, Echo. I I have some dried fruit here. All right, you are not producing enough lumber here. I will eat that shit with a spoon. I will puncture a top in the can and pour it down my throat. I love it. It's so hard to do baking with condensed milk because I just want to just eat it as it is. Jackie. But yeah, like I ran out of, of non-dairy creamer last week and I ended up buying a bottle of every now and then you can get the, like the large bottles of like French vanilla like the pump creamer um, but it's that's shelf stable and so that's what I'm using at the moment but it still doesn't have the right the right feel. You're not. Oh shit. I may need more ether shards. We gotta go spooter hunting. Need to take those shards out. I, oh man, I love this so much. I cannot wait for the full release of this game. There's so much in it. And it's pretty as well. Eko, I love that you take pictures of stuff when you're shopping. I do the same thing. Flint's like, what are you doing? I'm like, look, it says such and such and it's funny, okay? So you need logs. Oh, there we go. There's a group coming in of five. Is that it? Do I only have five? Seven.
I need, um, what? 40, 50 blades. See, now why are you coming back with planks? Are you full? Just don't have enough logs. Maybe. Oh, Echo. I don't know if you saw my post in Discord about, um, the single player's game that I started for Vintage Story. Imagine you've been busy. Um, but the... Playing in... Yeah, in Homo Sapiens mode, but with the lore content enabled, is... probably, like, the best experience. Yeah. Mate, could you tr just like bump it up, please? Um, and that path one, that path mod is really interesting. At first, I was like, what the fuck is happening? Because I thought it would just like, I don't know, do something to the map. But what it does is when you walk along, it like trims the grass behind you. Um, so it's, you can sort of look behind, like if you walk through a field of grass and look behind you, you can sort of see your path that you took sort of meandering behind you, but the grass eventually regrows. It's the same as if you just cut it with a knife. But there's something I don't know, quite charming about it. Yeah. And the auto map marking one is quite nice as well. I was going to put another... So what we're going to do here is Okay. Mm. 
Interesting. I don't know what I'm doing. All right. Okay. Oh, we have ads running for the the next three minutes. Go back over here. I'm gonna take a break. You guys should too. And uh, sit up, stretch, have a wee, and uh, I will be back shortly.
Okay. <laughs> Just realized that I don't have one in the air. So let's have a look at... Yeah, fine. Well, at least you search but I made and not search for we. Takes 48 seconds to make one of those. So crafty sparks seem like they are better to use. Crafty spark. Yeah, do. You've got your very own pile here. So this is... This game is so fucking cute. It's ridiculous. I recommend it. Like, look at this. You've got an output of seven and a half units per minute on the, the timber here. With an output of 15 items per minute here. I'm assuming this is output or throughput. know why I'm bothered with that one. So the little dudes with arms are more efficient. So I kind of need to... Switch them out. from did I accidentally cancel a bunch If we make all the ones at the crafting tables, the crafty sparks. Except for that one, I don't care about that one. Well, actually. I 
I'm not entirely sure what more efficient means. Okay, so we've almost got Can I change that one now? They can only do that one. Okay, fine. I'm curious if it'll let me make the um, crafty spark one up here. Basically, yeah. Okay, so we're going to Also hitches on autosave, so that's fun. Um, I believe at some point you will unlock better paths and things. So we need
They should be a lot better there. Alright, and then... It'll go up there. So this takes length. I don't know that that's going to be any more efficient, but... sound effects so much. So I'm pretty sure I've managed to soft log progress. Um, <laughs> but that that's okay. It's just demo. Due to drop in April, which has no bearing on the price, um, it it feels. I feel like it may be around twenty five thirty. Um, because handy games do usually don't price their games too high, but I I don't know. I'm enjoying it. Like it, it was supposed to be a three hour demo. I've been playing it for nearly five and a half hours. I was supposed to do something else, but I didn't want to. I don't know that reference. Okay, I don't need that anymore.
It it is. I am enjoying this. I mean, slay. I think my absolute favorite thing is just to like send them all out. And then hearing them like, wee! <laughs> wee! Mew. Mew. It's just so cute. Walnut seeds are- oh, are they? Interesting. I've got- I've got good you I've got good work use out of this. Okay. Here's- I can't progress in the game anymore, so I'm really just fucking around for the sake of it. So, here's the question. Like, I'm so gonna beg and grovel for a full key on release. Um, do I keep on putzing around on this? Do I switch over to Vintage Story? Or do we take a look at Powder, which is the uh, video clipping thing that I was going to look at earlier? So I like this, but I can't progress any further because it's stuck. <laughs> Oh, Ali. Um, you're gonna have to put this on your wish list. It's so much fun. There is a like the I mean there's also combat too which was interesting in that my little dudes didn't get I wasn't attacked like I my character didn't go into combat it was the the little sparks that got nommed by the giant bee elephant which is a bee elephant It was a tragic bee. It was. Okay. I have really enjoyed this game. Very much. But I can't progress. So I think it's time to. Uh, yeah. I can just keep playing, but whoa, there's like a flying fox. 